Welcome everyone. It's Adrian here. Thanks for stopping by. If it's your first time, welcome, and I hope it won't be your last. And my returning friends, thank you so very, very much. I really, really appreciate it. Oh, we are moving into the cooler days for us here in Oregon. Uh, it feels very, very good. And in fact, I keep getting a little bit chilled and short sleeve t-shirts aren't quite enough. But for right this minute, we'll be able to tough it out. I think it's probably 68 degrees or something like that. Mm. Well, I have some really, really fun things to show you from Timu. Timu. Yes, indeed. Timu. Oh, so let's dive right in. White bag, here we come. All right. I've been wanting to get something that I can show my rings in and I can organize them for myself. So I was able to get this darling pink one and it's velvety kind of flocked all the way around with lots of spaces to be able to put the rings in. And this was only $2.27. Yay, pretty, pretty, pretty. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I adore these earrings. Do you see their little campfire fire logs? Well, I saw, are we there yet? Haul these and I had to have them. You know, I love acrylic jewelry. Case in point, all the rings that I'm wearing. Except that of course is in the color. Anyhow, these were only 89 cents. Oh, look at that. Look. Mm hmm Little campfire. Fabulous. And I think these will look very, very charming with the um, cowboy print shirt that I hauled earlier. So, yay, campfire and cowboys. That'll go together, won't it? <laughs> All right, so many people for $2.49 have been buying these multiple bracelets all for one price, $2.49. Now, this is a lovely turquoise set. You've got the idea of like some chains and a faux crystal hanging down and the colorful little beads. These are gonna go really nicely with my turquoise glasses. I think that's gonna be special, don't you? Yay! Easy to put on, elastic, very, very pretty. And I'm digging in my bag here because I'm saying these are going to go with my turquoise glasses. Well, how about turquoise hair? Yes, indeed. We got to have some more space bun colors. And these beautiful, beautiful turquoise ones were only $1.17. I think that's the most inexpensive I've been able to buy them. And I think I have about five pairs of these in different colors. So I'm just gonna rip it right out of the bags. Oh, I just love them. Look at that shade, it's just so pretty. Oh my gosh, that's pretty. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna love it. I'm gonna love it. Yay! <laughs> way to go, way to go, Timu. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Look at this, $1.78. And I got, there's two to a set. So there's four 
of these white buttons, as it were, that everybody buy in the bog bag, just in case your buttons come apart, this or that type of a thing, um, I have a replacement. So I'm ready for anything now. Nothing's going to make my bog bag knock off, get um, out of commission. Yeah, going to always have that. Okay, what else is in the bag, goose? Remember I told you, when I say goose, I mean granny goose. That was my favorite potato chips, and the goose was always fun. So, what's up, goose? It's granny goose. Now, we have another ring. Yes, it's an acrylic, and in fact, I did believe I had my scissors up here already. What did I do? What did I do? What did I do with the scissors? There they are. Let's go ahead and release this ring from captivity. Yes. Look at that. Look at that. Yes. Beautiful black setting teardrop diamond. I have this exact ring in a goldenrod mustardy kind of a color with that same teardrop diamond. And I really like it. So, ah, it is a beauty, people. It is a beauty. Oopsie doodle. And of course, comes in a myriad of different colors. So I picked up the black one because I have a few different black, 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 no, black <laughs> rings that I need a few more to be able to do my, just what you're seeing. <laughs> okay, so again, that was only 98 cents and I always kind of check to make sure, like, Adrian, be careful because the stone is just glued on. There's no prongs. So I want to kind of, like, be aware not to hit it and knock it out, right? Okay. I got a few more things in this bag. So I'm going to go ahead. This I got, they were two for two forty-seven. I previously bought a single one and really, really works out. So they are considered help for arthritis. And osteoarthritis is this pad of our thumb right here. And I could tell mine was coming because this knuckle, I knew, was a precursor of being knowing I was going to be getting some arthritis. That doesn't hurt. Mm -mm, that one doesn't hurt. But the pads do hurt, um, clenching and things. So, yeah, new style of life here. So these, they are a flesh color, and it is a ivory-ish beige and comes with the little goodies you see there. They are magnets and they're on both side of the thumb housing. So super, super stretchy, easy to put on, put it on with all my rings, no problem. Okay. They've even scalloped cutting here, so it just goes really nicely into your wrist area. And like I say, you you know, it doesn't scream, see me, see me. And that silicone, as you can see, it's keeping my thumb protected and it is, um, very, very supple, easy, you know, hand movement. Let's go ahead and put the other one on. I was losing my words there to explain. Goodness, Adrienne. 
All right. Now, what I learned from the first one that I purchased is yeah, yeah, silicone, yeah, yeah, you sweat, right? Because it's just not breathable. And you can sweat underneath. Well, I have to be careful because when I was sweating and my skin so dry and gets so itchy that I really started scratching, scratching. And um, when your skin is damp and you go to be scratching it, you can just create a sore by sort of that wet skin peeling and making a sore. So be careful, be careful when you're wearing things like this, knowing that um, sweat is gonna be part of what happens. And keep yourself dry as possible. Okay, let me show you something that I thought was really going to be a lot smaller. Oh, a lot smaller. For $2.98. People, when I saw this, I thought it was a ring. I thought it was a ring when I was looking at it. It's a bracelet. So here we go with my favorite sort of goldenrod mustery color. This is gonna go with a lot of rings that I do have. And that's why I was like, oh, look at a gorgeous ring. That'll match my other rings. Yay. Well, all you gotta do is put your hand in I don't intentionally buy bangle bracelets anymore because they hit around the um, around my wrist area and such like that. Um, but I'm stoked. Look, that is a perfect, perfect, perfect Adrian bracelet. About an inch wide and a quarter inch thick. It's not bake like but it could be Bakelite. <laughs> Bakelite, if you don't know, was a plastic jewelry that was phenomenally popular in the 50s and such. And nowadays, if you find real Bakelite, you pay a lot for it. But every color on here, fantastic. This is so worth the $2.98. Well, speaking of bracelets, I'll buy, I will assure you, no gem popped out and the bracelet did not break. It's over by the fireplace now. We'll have to get it later, people. Because at the moment, speaking of bracelets, What have I got here? What have I got here? Well, we all know if it's blue, I want it. And if it's silicone, I definitely want it. Can't hurt your wrists with something this soft. So here you have a chain looking beautiful shade of blue silicone bracelet followed up yes the orange that's very 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 matchy matchy for my bog bog bag that i purchased and showed you earlier so let's get that one on there now look at how much volume they add as a jewelry I guess they really do go so well with this beautiful pin. This was an artist's piece. It's kind of balsa cardboardy something. Very, very, very lightweight. So you've got the background piece that's a building with 
uh, blue windows and yellow lights shining through to this middle piece, that's the red building. You see the roof and more yellow lights behind the windows and this fabulous yellow animal. His blue eyes going with the blue. So I've probably had this for at least, at least 25 years, yeah. Sausalito is a beautiful area in California, and I lived there for a while. And at a art fair, I saw this, and one of my coworkers bought it for me. I was over the moon. I'll always remember that kind <laughs> kindness, Adrian. You remember the kindness. So. I have my beautiful, beautiful pin. And if people are having a hard time reading my shirt, it says, do I look like a people person? <laughs> well, we all know I can let go and be a people person when I want to be. Yeah, being in retail and wholesale and always around people. Um, yeah, very outgoing, total extrovert until I turn on my introvert side and then really ratchet it to my recluse personality. Yes, but I'm not done. There's room for another bracelet. And this one, I, did I tell you the price on these? These are $2.97 each, $2.97 each. And for some wonderful reason, I was able to get the colorful one for only $1.87. Wow! Wow! So, okay. Look at those colors. And with the black in there, you know, that's going to tie in black jewelry. So there we have it. Huh? What do you think? Shall we put a color on each side of the multicolor one? So in the neighborhood of $9, this is $50 worth of looking jewelry. I could have seen it at like a very fashionable store in New York, Barney's. Mm -hmm. I love when we get our faux jewelry for such reasonable prices. Um, I adore these three bracelets and you'll be seeing them quite often I'm sure in upcoming videos because they match everything I like to wear including today. <laughs> I do have on one of my favorite bracelets in my collection. I think you're seeing it can really you know it's faceted cut on all those red stones they really pick up a shine. They are very diamond-like. And this is a wired bracelet. Isn't that exquisite? I've had this for quite a while. Oh, I absolutely love it. As I tell you all, I was a cashier at a bookstore for quite a while. And when you're a cashier and your hands are always on display, I got into nails, rings, and bracelets. And I've never stopped, absolutely never. Okay, here's one more item here. Wow! Now, this one's going to surprise you. You know, they've been showing a lot of these chenille see-through bags, vinyl, with heavy-duty, good zipper hardware. This even has the little handle. You could take it off, but otherwise you've got a wristlet. Well, they are average $7, let's say, on Timu which was a replica 
of a much, much more expensive chenille brand with the letters. Well, Timu, Timu came through and I think that this is a dupe of the dupe. <laughs> because I was lucky enough to score this one for only $2.39. And it came, look at that with the wonderful cow print. So I keep talking about my bog bag, which is the big rubber satchel -y bag um, and having this as like an insert in there because we have you know fall winter coming and that means there will be precipitation also known as and my plastic bog bag could be letting water in because <laughs> it has the holes on the side <laughs> so I'm going to just be really stoked to have this as one of the uh, alternative interior satchels that I'll be carrying in that purse. I just love this to pieces. Absolutely Mises to pieces. <laughs> okay. Well, I hope everybody enjoyed this to the max. And there's one other item I want to show you. When it arrived, it was rather pulled into itself and smushed and had a little, little tiny fabric tear on it. What are we talking about, Adrian? Well, last year when I saw these bags, I really, really, really wanted one. And I didn't pull the trigger. But this year, $6.99, it's the classic basketball purse. <laughs> we have a long gold hardware with matching leatherette in the same texture as the ball, which really has a texture that reminds you of the skin of a basketball. And look how supple. This is so supple and pretty. I love it. Then, very fashionable or the plastic chain link handles. This does zip easily <laughs> for a little round bag. Let's keep working it. There you go. So nothing's going to fall out of your basketball purse. I just think it is so darn adorable. Well, I've been working for some time now to get it in, to be a reshaped. I had asked Timu for a refund because it was so smashed into itself. And then again, that little tear of the pleather was unattractive. And they did, and they said, go ahead and get keep it, give it to charity, throw it away, do what you want. Very, very kind. Thank you, Chimu. But everybody, these come in many colors. I love the pink one, the pink basketball from last year, way before Barbie. White. There's a larger size that is uh, covered in written graffiti around it. So just put in basketball purse. And in fact, there's even a smaller size than this one, a mini. A total mini, which I'm sure is beyond adorable in person. But this one is classic. They didn't even spell basketball wrong. <laughs> and I zipped it up for you. Let's unzip it. And you can see just a nice black fabric 
bonded interior. Just it'll hold a phone and your lipstick and your coin purse and your ID. Just enough things. Let's see. Would we like it as a crossbody? Let's check it out, shall we? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. White men can't jump and neither can white women. <laughs> All right. I had a lot of fun. I hope you did. We saw a lot of jewelry and I am stoked, stoked, stoked. And I'll be back again soon because I have another white little Timu bag waiting to show you. Okay? Thank you, everybody. Thank you so very, very much. Bye for now. Bye for now. Don't forget to subscribe. Thumbs up, like if you enjoyed the content. Content and me. <laughs> And of course, leave a comment, just an emoji, emoji art. If you have a question about anything, feel free to ask. And feel free just to write something about yourself, how your day was going. This channel for me was about making friends and I'm getting such a good tight group that we're starting to be able to communicate in the comments and get to know each other better. And I just appreciate that so, so very much. And one of my main people that I am doing that with right now continues to be Tina. Thank you, Tina. As ever, keep sending me those compliments. You know, my ego needs them. Oh, yeah, Adrian, like you really need more ego. <laughs> so I mentioned... Uh, are we there yet? So feel free to go over and check her channel out. She actually gave me a shout out on her channel and I am so grateful. I have at least 50 new subscribers that came over. Thanks very, very much to Cheryl. Cheryl? 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 Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Okay, enough nonsense. <laughs> Here comes the finger. <laughs>